Hi my beauties, Yelena here from NLA Cosmetics. I'm so excited today because today I'm gonna to be filming part two of Surviving the Jewish Holidays, Beauty Edition. And uh, I'm going to be doing two colors on the top upper lid so you guys can take a full advantage of being all fully glammed and going out there and before the holidays uh, you're going to go and try on different looks today I'm going to be using two colors um, on top here without overlapping them so all kosher girls all kosher don't worry before you continue don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification sign if you'd like to see how I created this look then keep on watching so I promised you that I'm going to create something different. So today I'm going to be using two shadows on top and I'll show you how to do it so it doesn't overlap. The one universal color that I think every single person with any skin tone can use is buff. Buff is a gorgeous color. I'm gonna show you. You see this color? It's so beautiful and very fresh. What I'm gonna do with it is I'm gonna use it right here. So you're gonna grab a teeny bit and just put it right there. As you can see, that brought a ton of light to my eyes. Doing the same thing on the side. That's it, very simple. Now we're gonna switch the brush. We're gonna grab four and one this side. Since I'm, wear since I'm wearing kind of uh, bright colors, right? There's browns and there's blues. I'm gonna grab the brown color. And this one is Molten Lava. Let me show you what it looks like. You see this color? It's a stunning, stunning shade. So I'm going to just go in it. and right into the crease. Notice how I'm not connecting the two colors. There's just nothing there. If you can see this part here, it's completely bare. So there is no makeup there. Look, there's nothing there. So they're not. So whatever else left on the brush, I just brushed it into the brow bone because it's such a glittery color. It's so bright that you can put a lot of concentration here and then just kind of diffuse it up. And that way you'll see, it looks like you did a, a few colors there. The same thing we're gonna do with this eye. So the next thing I'm going to do is my blush because I want to put the blush and then apply the foundation wherever I need in order to just cover up any imperfections that I feel are not supposed to be there. Okay, so I'm going in with my blush and 4-in-1 brush side that is the blush side, right? 4-in-1. So the same idea, you have holes in here, you poke some holes and then you just throw some, like just push some of that blush onto the lid. up like this smile just build it up 
Okay, so you see that the difference between the two? Okay, and the same thing on the other side. You see that? Now, instead of the blush, you can just put the whole foundation on the whole face. If, for example, you really, really need to cover the whole face and that's more important to you, that's fine. Just apply the foundation on the whole face. If you'd like for me to do a tutorial on that, I'm happy to do that. But basically, you're going to use this side of the brush or whichever brush you're going to be using for the foundation and you're just going to apply it all over the place if you're not using the blush now i'm done with my blush so what i'm going to do next is i'm going to apply foundation okay tap I'm not going into this inner corner there because I already applied that bright colors buff. So I'm avoiding this area, but everywhere else where it's clean, I am applying it. Do you see how much I'm glowing right now? It's because I'm using the, the formulation that's a little bit more shiny. I do have matte, so for you who have more textured skin, right, like a really large pores or something on your face that you don't want to be have some so pronounced, okay, then use the matte foundation. We have two different uh, powder foundations and you can find them under the Shabbat. Um, tab on my website so once you're done with the makeup and you're happy with it the last thing that i do is the lip powder and uh, the one that i'm going to be using today is is a berry color so i'm picking it up like this you don't have to do it with a brush you can do it with your finger put your pinky here Did you notice how I put it on? I went from inside out, right? in, out, in, out. I applied it this way instead of applying it this way. That way you're going to ensure a really nice smooth application. Same thing with the upper. Put your pinky for control and go from down up. And then connected and that's it this is a very simple look but it looks so beautiful and glam now you can do this look with any colors any of the shimmers that's the beauty of it I just wanted to show you how you can put two colors and look absolutely stunning you can also put a third color right here without touching the rest of it with a tiny little brush um, just apply a little liner if you'd like to see how I did the previous look which is the part one of this series I'm going to link it down below so you can see it and uh, create that different look that I've done last time I did a little bit of a smoke into the crease and I did a liner beautiful liner and I also did false lashes I love falsies but I wanted to give you a little of a different look so uh, stay tuned for the for part three I think it's really really exciting I'm doing so many looks um, I hope you're taking advantage of these looks and you're going to actually do them on coming holiday and also you can do them on Shabbat you can do them the whole day you can reapply the colors you don't have to put it on before you can apply everything on the day of for all the rules uh, we have them on our website or analycosmetics.com we have a specific section for Shabbat also I will link I will 
put all the rules again down below. Uh, please subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification sign so you never miss another video. These videos are more educational. I hope that these videos help you. Um, if they are helping you, please put the like and share it with your friends. That would really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video.